Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will show you the best way that I know to play Windows game on Mac OS device. As you can see right now, I'm using my old 2018 MacBook Pro to play GTA 5 and it's very very smooth. The solution I will show you in this video is I'm using a remote desktop app that allow me to connect to a Windows PC. This one is very different compared to Beamer or any that because it's very very slow. This one is very smooth. I control using the Mac OS keyboard and Mac OS touchpad. It's very very low latency and it's the best option to game on Mac OS device. So I will show you step by step in this video how you can install Sunshine on both macOS and Windows and how you can use it and set up it like you can see right now. Let's jump to the videos. As you can see, I'm using Windows 11 over here, so I will install Moonlight and Sunshine to my device right now. First of all, you can go to Google and do search for Sunshine Remote. You will go to official homepage over here. If you want to use this device as a host device, you will scroll all the way down to here. You don't need to install the client's app. You need to install the Sunshine app in your device. You can see we have the latest for Windows, so I will download this one on GitHub. This will navigate you to a GitHub website. You can see we have the latest version over here. And you can read some description related to the Sunshine app. Now when you scroll all the way down, we have Sunshine for Windows installer. We also have Sunshine for Windows Portable. So now I will download Sunshine Windows installer. You can see here we have the Sunshine installer over here. So I will run this to install Sunshine to my device. Now you're good. Next. Next. I agree. Next. Next and install. You can see why install link is will navigate to the documentation of Sunshine and you can read everything related to Sunshine over here. Okay, now the installation are complete. I will choose finish over here and now I will run the Sunshine app. But after install link, you don't see anything happen. So how you can run Sunshine? The first option is you go over here. You will see we have the Sunshine icon over here and you can right click and you choose open Sunshine. Or you have other options that you go to start and you can see we have Sunshine over here. You can pin this one to start and now you can run the sunshine it will navigate you to the local host website we have the notification that your connection is not private so you just skip it you don't need to care about it you choose expand and you continue to local host now we need to make new username and password to access the sunshine web ui you will create your old username and password Okay, now you finally create and log in to Sunshine app. You are running the latest version of Sunshine. Now I will show you how to use a client machine to connect to my PC over here. You can see we have the pin icon over here. You will choose that. And you can see we have the pin pairing and the device name. You need to install Moonlight Client app in your client device to get a pin and connect to my device. Okay, now you can see I'm using completely new client device and I connect to the same Wi-Fi as my host device here. So I already installed Moonlight Client over here and you can see in the same Wi-Fi it's automatically recognized my device over here. It's called Z790. If you can't find your host device, you can navigate to this icon over here and you add a PC manually. Enter the IP address of your host PC. To get the IP address, go to CMD on your host device and you type in IP config and it will show you the IP address of your host PC. You paste to here and you will able to see your host device show right in Moonlight Client Apps. Now in the first connection you will see we have the lock icon over here. So to unlock it you will choose this one and it will ask you to enter the four digit code to your host PC. Now you need to come back to your host device and type in this pin code. That is a four digit pin. Now you can type in your device name. You can type any name you want. This one calling Surface Go is my client device, so I will choose send over here. Okay, you can see the success. Please check in the moonlight to continue. I come back to my client device and now you can freely connect to your host device anytime you want. As you can see, I'm using Mac OS right now. If you want to use your Mac device as a client and you will connect to a host device, you will scroll down, you will find the client over here and to install the client for Mac OS, you will choose this option, download for GitHub. You can see the client software is Moonlight and its latest version v6.1. You will scroll down and you will see we have the Mac OS 
universal over here you will download this one okay after you download you will run the installation now it's very easy you just drag this moonlight app the application over here it's very quick after you complete you need to run moonlight application you will choose open over here you need to allow moonlight to find your device in local network okay you finally finish install moonlight client app if you want to use your mac OS device as a client device it's very easy you open the moonlight app over here and you find the host device that shown here you choose this one you unlock it and connect to your host device it's very easy okay i'm using macbook pro right now and behind the macbook is my windows pc you can see i'm open moonlight app right now are uh, running in my mac os and you can see the calling z790 this one is my windows 11 pc and now i will connect to my windows pc i will choose desktop and i will starting to connect to my windows pc as you can see in my Windows PC, I'm running the games called GTA 5. This one is very heavy game and you can see I'm using my MacBook touchpad and MacBook keyboard to play this game and you can see everything is very very smooth. You can see over here I'm using touchpad and I feel there's zero latency when I'm using my MacBook keyboard and MacBook touchpad. So for me, it is the best way for you to play games on macOS. Okay, basically that all the steps for you to install Moonlight for client and Sunshine apps. But remember, you need to have the same internet connection to able to use your client device to connect to your host device. If you want to use some different internet connection to connect to your host device, for example, you have your host device at home and you need to use a client device from your home and connect remotely to your host device. You want to use cellular internet, LTE, 4G, 5G to connect to your host device at home. How you can do it? I already made a video that shows you the solution to use different internet connection for Moonlight and Sunshine. You can check this video right over here. Okay, that's all my videos. If my video is helpful, please give me a like and subscribe and drop a comment below if you want to ask anything. I will see you in my next videos.